What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Happy to be to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Um, I received <clears throat> some more channel messages. I'm going to deliver them. They're flying in today. So I guess I've already walked today. So I might walk again. So we're going to do it. Okay. So the channel message I re or messages rather I received was, okay, now one message may resonate, two may resonate, two plus may resonate, none may resonate. If this isn't your story, it's not your story. You have to plug yourself in where you fit if you do. If you don't, it may be somebody you're connected to or you just might like listening to the stories. I'm not sure. Only you know your story, not anybody else, okay? Okay, so the channel messages I heard was an Aries and a Taurus that once heavily stole from a feminine energy in the past. I heard um, the karma is about to shift and the energy is about to shift in a huge way. I heard they stole very, very, very large amounts of money from this feminine energy. I heard soon they are about to get stole from um, from some they someone they would have never expected. Very, 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 very large amount of money. In one of these cases, more money than they stole from the feminine energy. And I heard it was over a course of years, too. So you plug it in how it resonates. So they stole, I mean, it was over a course of years they stole from her. Um, it could be a masculine or a fem, Taurus, masculine or fem, Aries is what I'm feeling. But it's a feminine energy they stole from. Now, for some of you guys, you could be the feminine energy they stole from. But it's Aries and the Taurus, masculine or fem, Aries or Taurus. I heard they stole from her a huge amount of money. So not just like 20 bucks, 200 bucks, 2,000 maybe. I'm a huge ass amount over the course of years. So it wasn't just one time, years of it. Now, how they did it, I have no damn idea. But only they know how they did it, not anybody else. Or maybe other people do. I don't know. But however that resonates, I heard the energy is about to boomerang back. And their asses are about to get stole from. In one of these situations, it's going to be even more money than they stole from her over the course of years. So whatever kind of, whatever money they stole in one situation, it's going to be more than they ended up. They're going to get stole from more than they stole from her. So you plug it in how it resonates. That's pretty sad, man. That's sad. Sad as hell. They could have Aries or Taurus and they're seminarizing Venus or Femme in Hammer Jupiter charge. You plug it in how it resonates. Spirit, let me introduce you have uh, for this like this. And in one of these situations, an on and off cancer relationship is about to find out they're pregnant. Baby number two. And the financial situation is going to be completely different this time. Financial lack. Oh my God. So I heard in one of these situations, there's like an on and off, like third party energy. I heard on and off relationship. So I feel it's like a third party or a on and off sexual relationship or a sneaky link or a makeup breakup makeup breakup what have you with some kind of cancerian energy so i'm assuming a fem cancer they could have cancer in their semi rising venus or feminine hammer jupiter charts so i feel like one of these people is masculine the aries aries or the taurus is a masculine one of them is because somebody's dealing with the feminine cancer over here uh on and off sexual it could be a fling thing i don't know but in one of these situations for one of these people they're going to find out the cancer is pregnant. I heard baby number two. And I heard it's going to be a completely different financial situation this time. Financial lack. And we have concern. So uh, I think they're about to be concerned after their butt gets stole from. Uh, number 33 could be a very significant number of one's life. Number 33. It could be a significant number of these people. Or a significant number of the cancer. Or the feminine energy. Or maybe you guys if you know the story. However this resonates. Number 33. They are about to be shocked as hell. The money is about to disappear for good. 
They are about to be shocked as hell. The money is about to disappear for good. A herd is about to get stolen from people they would have never, <clears throat> person or people they would have never expected to steal it from. Um, steal it from. How, I don't know if it's like in a suitcase, in a mattress, in a safe, in an account. I don't. I didn't hear any of that. But <clears throat> somebody closely connected to them knows about this money. Somebody does. They're about to, I mean, they're about to take it. Gone girl energy. They're about, I mean, I'm not saying it's a feminine energy that's about to take it, because I don't know. But I feel like gone girl energy. They're about to take that shit and run, whether it's a masculine or a feminine. And in one of these situations, it's more money than they stole. In one situation, somebody's about to knock up on and off cancer. Baby number two. So somebody over here already has a child, I feel, by this cancer. And it's about to be a completely different financial situation because they're not only about to get stole from negative karma cycling around because they stole from her, the feminine energy, over the course of years. But um, concerned probably because of the child and pending pregnancy when they find out about this child. I don't think they found out yet that this cancer is pregnant. Sounds like it's upcoming in the universe. Wow. Spirit messages you have for places. Occupation lovers. Number 34, 15. Can you raise and mix the numbers of one's life? 34 or 15. It can be possible ages of a child of one of these people or you or somebody you're connected to or age of you or somebody you're connected to. 34 and 15. In one of these situations, a strict no fraternization policy is in effect in their workplace. The pregnancy is going to force one of these people out. In one of these situations, there's a no fraternization policy in their workplace. And in one of these situations, it's going to force one of these people out. So I think they work together. I think the Cancer works with the Taurus or the Aries is exactly what I think. Exactly what I think. You plug it in how it resonates. I think the pregnancy, I think one of the Cancer, I'm sorry, the Taurus or the Aries works with the Cancer. Cancer is about to end up pregnant. Lover's upright. It's about to force one of the people out. I don't know if it's the pregnant one or the other one, uh, the one that impregnated. Uh, you plug it in how it resonates. And we have occupation. So, yeah, that's co-worker energy all day long. All day long, man. Let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, I didn't. I'm going to shuffle again. I feel guided to shuffle these. Spirit messages here. I like this. Movement reverse. I heard take them. Karma upright. Serious heavy karma coming for these people. Serious. Huge money losses coming in all directions, soon and quickly. Huge karma coming for these people, soon and quickly. Huge money loss coming for these people in all directions, soon and quickly. 
So this Aries and this Taurus feed that stop is they sold from a feminine energy for years, but now they're caught up in shit. I mean, well, all I'm hearing is charge after charge after charge. I mean, theft, that's a huge ass thing. And in some occupations, you can't even work in occupations if you are charged with a, a theft charge. And that's just the truth. I mean, that's just the truth for real, for real. I wonder what kind of occupation they work in. They work, definitely work in a workplace, I'll tell you that. And I'm feeling a professional workplace for some of these people. Hope it's not healthcare. Because um, that they, especially like nursing, they take theft very, very, very seriously. And that's just the truth. You get charged with something like that. That is the truth. I don't know what kind of profession they work in, though. But I heard uh, money loss is about to come all over the place for these people. Well, one of the ways is that huge, uh, there, somebody that they don't expect is about to steal this money from them. Um, one of these cases, more money than they stole from the feminine energy over the course of years. And um, I think they're about to be stuck. They're about to be stuck. One of them is about to be stuck at baby number two. And I don't feel this is something they wanted because I heard it was an on and off relationship. So I don't think it's something that they expected or wanted. They might end up wanting the child, but I, I definitely not. A pregnancy they expected. So stuck energy movement and stuck because of the money about to be stolen. Heard money loss coming in all directions soon. So I mean soon and quickly and soon and quickly. And but it's their karma. It's their karma uh, because they shouldn't have stole from the feminine energy of the course of years. You plug it in how it resonates. Mm. And one of these people's co-workers are about to call federal agents and report everything they know on them. Severe criminals. And one of these people's co-workers are about to call federal agents, I heard, and report everything they know on them. Severe criminals. And things are about to start moving quickly with this. Quickly. And things are about to start moving quickly with this. Quickly. So it sounds like after the co-worker Maybe you're the co-worker that knows this situation, possibly. I have 13,050 of you guys on here, so you really have to plug yourself in where you fit. I feel for one of you guys, you might be the co-workers of these people. I do. Of the Cancer, the Taurus, or the Aries. Uh, cancer about to find out you're pregnant with baby number two. There's a um, no front rosation policy, meaning I don't think they're allowed to date inside the workplace. Um, that's going to force one of them out. But... I'm sure she knows about the theft. I'm sure they obviously know about the theft. Um, I think, co-worker, you know about the theft, or you're about to find out about the theft, and you are about to, I heard you're about to call federal agents and reveal everything you know on this. So, um, and I heard it's going to move, it's going to move things quickly. So when you make the phone call, co-worker, just know it's going to make things move quickly. Um, sounds like you're going to get the right agent or agents or agency. And it's going to move quickly. Just know that, okay? Whoever you are, um, co-op of the Aries and the Taurus, okay? One of these people is a masculine energy, the Aries and the Taurus. Um, one might be them. Maybe. You plug it in how it resonates. But one is definitely masculine because they knocked up or about, well, sounds like they've either knocked up the cancer or they're about to knock her up. Just saying, just saying. And they're co-workers. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh my God. These people are about to seriously regret stealing from a chosen one. Oh my God. I heard these people are about to seriously regret stealing from a chosen one. So maybe you're the feminine energy chosen one they've stole from in some of these situations. I'm feeling for some of you guys. And for some situations, I feel you're the co-worker about to report these assholes um, to the feds. Some situations, you could be the uh, cancer. Uh, cancer. Baby mama, what have you, what have you. Some situations, you could be thieves. I don't know. Only you know your story, not anybody else, okay? Um, but these people stole from a chosen one. They stole from a chosen one. It, their, their karma's about to come around. 
20 fold soon and quickly. 20 fold soon and quickly is what I just heard. Their car is about to come around 20 fold soon and quickly. I don't want to be in the middle of that car. All right. I love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful day. Namaste.